In this presentation, we will be evaluating the relationships in a parallel RL circuit and what happens to values on individual components and totals when we change the frequency. In this case, if we increase the frequency to a certain value, then that will have a direct effect on the inductive reactants. If we increase the frequency, then the inductive reactants also will increase. So if the overall opposition to current flow increases, then the current flow must also decrease. Total current flow. If we have X amount of current at 60 hertz and we increase the frequency and the inductive reactance goes up, then the total current flow is going to decrease to some value. And when we decrease it to that value, that is going to change angle theta and power factor as well. So angle theta is going to decrease. And angle theta and power factor are an inverse relationship if angle theta goes down. Power factor will also increase. And looking at impedance, if the inductive reactance increased, then the overall uh, impedance has to increase also, that relationship with current. We can take a look at what will happen with the uh, total power, wattage, and reactive power. Well, the wattage and the resistance both of them are unchanging. Those values remain the same. And the VARs, if we in, uh, decrease the reactive current, then that means the reactive power has to go down. So if the reactive power went down, the volt amps also have to go down. Once again, that is a relationship between those two. One affects the other. 